Hey everybody, this is Co Impact with Let's Play Sam and Max Hit the Road, and we're back here at the Ball of Twine. I'm gonna talk to this man one last time. He's gonna give me a reason. How much are they paying you anyway? One last time. I'm a volunteer, but they let me sleep here, and I get all the twine I can yeah, eat. Yeah, yeah, we know you can eat the twine. So I'm gonna talk about I the move ring. Oh, the ring isn't an option. The mood ring isn't an option. Oh, well, be all okay. For now. Well, there's an easy solution to this. Words like big and large only begin to describe this thing. I think stupid and inane would be useful additions. <laughs> Not to Good job the there, text. Max. Okay. Well, I can't cut off a piece of twine in the middle. That would destroy its status as the biggest ball of twine in the world. Well, yeah, that's true. They would destroy you for it. I can't talk to that. This is a completely unusable thingamabob. Sure it is. Sure it is. So, uh, oh, I mean Sam. Whoa, I'm getting them both confused, and that should not be happening. No, no, don't worry. Don't worry. We have the solution right here. Fish magnet, go! Oh my god, there's so much stuff in here, like a hand grenade and a diamond and a human skull. That was wholesome. Got the mood ring, Not though. Not to mention physically improbable. Ah, we're swimming in physical improbabilities. I must be happy. I must be happy. The, the, the mood ring. Wait, wait, wait. Can we use this on Max? I can't use these things together. Ah, uh, we cannot. But we have Shavul's mood ring now, so you know what we gotta do? Go all the way back to Shavul. <laughs> oh, you gotta walk. All the way back to Shavul. Isn't that fun? Yeah, that's that's just excellent. Perfect. 110% not padding. Meep meep. Get out the way, asshole. Because here we are. <laughs> I know you guys want to watch the, the weird magnets do their thing, but I hope I don't have to reset the magnets. That would be annoying. I mean, I hope that the game would be smart enough. To remember my magnets were set to Shavul's color. It did. It did. It's still green. Although Max is really tiny, so he's gonna take extra time to go into the next room. You're back. Yeah, we did it. And we're bigger than a bread box. Oh. Three bread boxes even. Uh, maybe, I doubt it. Now? Food ring. Got is it. this your ring? Hey, how about a ring? Yeah, man, slow down. Oh, you gotta calm man. down, man. Have you found Frog Rock yet? Nope. No, but I don't see how finding it's going to get me any closer to finding Bruno. Finding Frog Rock's only the beginning, man. I'm sure it Once is. Once you're at Frog Rock, you'll need some samples. I already got those. Samples? Yeah, man. Bigfoot samples. You know, like, you uh, know, fur and stock, kung. Three of them. Bigfoot them kung. Over you know, it's that stuff that sticks between their toes. The but is Let's go, usually Max. only predominantly grown in the summer. Wait. You'll also need some mystic mole man powder. Oh, that just sounds like joking. drugs. No joke, man. Here, I'll get you some. It's real. It's not just for tripping. Here you go. Sprinkle this mystic mole man powder over the fur when you've smeared it all over frog rock. What'll happen then? Oh, I wonder. Something wonderful. Well, hopefully Thanks. we can Let's get that go, something Max. wonderful today. But unfortunately, we need to go find frog rock, which means we need to go all the way back to the diner where I set up that fish lens. All the way back a couple of episodes ago. Yeah, I wasn't just doing that out of, you know, random useless item gathering and such and so of point and click adventure variety. Oh my goodness. Get over there. Stop fucking around and get in there. Cut time for this. We're going to Frog Rock. I gotta, I gotta wait for that tram to come back anyway, so that's gonna be... So how's it been? How's it hanging? You know? Everyone... Not even what... I don't think people say that anymore anyway. 
I don't know what people speak these days. Leg, Humans Max. are complicated. I'm playing a game featuring an anthropomorphic dog and lagomorph. Round rabbity thingy. Wouldn't even qualify Max as anthropomorphic. That's just me. Excellent. Excellent. There's only one answer and one supply chain here. We're gonna use the lens. Whoa, whoa, lens, please. Okay, this way. Dead between the lights. Hmm, the largest stump in the world. That's, uh, that's not the rock. It's a rock. That's not the rock. Why, it's the eternal plane of acid rain. No, that is not the lights. Meaning that this is not going to be the rock. Nor it. Wait, that might, might be the rock. That's the enchanted argyle forest. Huh. I mean, I guess it really is argyle color, so... Should be fine. That's not the rock. It's the inexplicable valley of lights. All right. Did he say left or right of? Because that's important. This one might be the rock. It's a rock. No, no, no. He said to the right of. Come on. Hmm. It's a rock. Hmm. It's but a rock. Between the two things, Shavuul said it was between. It must Did Shavuul say it was rock. between two things? I thought he said it was just to the right of the board. I mean, the lights. Hey, Frog Rock is now on the world map. Let's get out of here. One out. One out I think buddy. I can see Frog Rock. Operate the elevator. I mean, hey, it's not the last time we'll be up here, ironically. There's still one more time that we have to go and use the tram and do all of this. We get to come to the Ball of Twine one more time, because I don't have the tool yet to get Bendy Guy to go do a thing. Unless I could have totally gotten the tool and I've, I missed it. Ugh. I'm hoping I didn't miss it. Where are you going, Sam? Sam, this way. I mean, I guess Sam and Max pathfinding is gonna be weird like this for this map. They kind of don't ever want to intersect. They don't want to walk the same path, so that's why they do this kind of shit. Wasting time. Frog Rock. Frog Rock. All right, Frog Rock. We did it. That barely looks like a frog. This doesn't look like a frog at all. My innocence has been shattered by this blatant tourist trap. I want my money back. <laughs> you got plenty we didn't of money. Pay anything. Well, somebody better give me some money. Give me the money. All right, so we're gonna need to do what Shabul told us to do. I'm gonna put in some of the, the samples. You. It's a charming decanter filled with vile and mysterious liquids. What happens it if I... It could be my long-lost twin brother, Sam. Oh, God. That's a pretty good joke. What happens... If I better put not that waste on this stuff until I smear all three Sasquatch samples on this rock. Ah, the fail safes. The fail safes of Lucas Arts. They won't let me do it. They just won't let me have my little fun so I can go back to Shavul and go to the mystery vortex and then grab more stuff. Nah, not at all. What in here can we? I don't use the rasp either, but then again, the rasp comes much later. <laughs> We need other stuff to be done first. That's gross, Sam. All right. Now we have a pile of like Bigfoot stuff. Oh, wait, that's the Jesse James hand. We don't want that. We want this. We want Shavul's magic brew. Oh, that's like an RPG maker sound effect well, too. It's a very stock sound effect. Wait for it. Wait for it. The, the, the moon walking. It was so powerful for a second there. Sure gets dark quickly around here. 
I don't think this is a natural occurrence, Max. Oh, it In probably fact, I think isn't. We're witnessing a celestial convergence of some sort. Or... Is that what they're calling it these days? Do you think it'll make that rock look more like a frog? Probably not. Whoa! Look at that CG saucer. Excellent. I didn't know that the mole men were from space. I'm not surprised, but maybe it's because I don't know the comics. Whoa! What the hell? This means something, Sam. Oh, of course, Conroy Bumpus. Why? Why haven't we ever thought of that? Can't look at the stars that got rearranged. I'm sure, that broke a lot of things. Well, I guess we go to Bumpusville now. What? What is the statue he has in his fountain? It's a Conroy world after all. If we ever get this rich and famous, I want you to shoot me, Sam. It'll be a pleasure. Gladly. Okay, let's go look at some of the stuff around here. Bumpusville. I wonder if Conroy's a member of Good Sam Club. This is a completely unusable oh, thingamabob. Oh, look at that. That's disgusting. He's like, his eye, like the eyeball icon just completely, completely disgustifies that, that, that entire hedge. Yes. I, I wish. can't talk to that. I it's wish customary to throw money into these things. Wait, I want to look at it first. A wishing well. Thank you. I wish I had absolute power to decide who lives and who dies. You already I have that. I think we'd need a bigger well. Can I throw I think it? we have to throw money in this thing. Okay. We're going to throw money in it. Easy enough. Got money. I wish this game were over. <gasps> you did it! Victory! Well, Hold this it. has been Quim Pack with... Oh. Get back here. We're dealing with a very literal well here. Well, okay, let's throw more money in. I wish I knew what Max was thinking. Nothing. Thinking buzz nothing. Well, that was a waste of money. How about I throw more money in? Nah, this thing's malfunctioning. Yeah, I'm sure it is, Sam. I'm sure it is. Let's go into bumper. What is this? Cripes. Hey, Max, take a look at this. It's oh titled my Me, Myself, and I. Hey, you learned how to read. What is this? Howdy, partners. I'm Conroy Bumpus, and welcome to Bumpusville. Did he just build, like, a Feel museum out of his house? Mansion, I mean, I guess that's the what they did do to Elvis's house, because he's like a parody anything. of Elvis, but he's also Australian. Howdy, and, you know, a whole bunch of I'm other stuff. Conroy Bumpus, and welcome to Bump... What in the heck is this robot? Conroy's first eight track tape. Flush down. It's a macro hard maintenance droid. I just wanted to see the macro hard. Oh, it's I get it. It's a gold record for Bumpuses. Heaven's just like Texas, except that there's no taxes. What? Okay. It's the platinum record Bumpus got for let's drink beer and shoot things. Oh, they're making fun of country. Country music it's a pretty gold hard record here. For Conroy's breakthrough hit. Two-fisted, beer drinking, gun toting, hard loving, fast driving country western liver puddlian. Wow. That was a mouthful. Unbelievable mouthful right there from Sam. It's a gold record for Conroy's runaway hit, Broken Hearted Roadkill on the Highway of Romance. Oh. <laughs> oh, the platinum record Conroy got for his all time hit, Smile When You Say That, You Rock and Rollin' Wimp. Damn. Bumpus got this gold record for Daddy's Two Steppin' in His Two Foot Grave. Two Foot Grave. Oh, my goodness. It's hard to believe that he sold a million of. Tobacco spit blues. Okay, I'll do one more thing before we end. We're gonna go into we're gonna go into Mr. Bumpus's room. Wow, it's Monster Truck Weekend. Damn, it. happening every Sunday. They're gonna do the show. Sunday, 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 okay. Sunday and Saturday. Shot now. I'm not, but I'm sure my gentle naivete will survive. The we we can't take the wig, unfortunately. I will it right now. It's one of Conroy's toupees. What we can do is we can go up here and get some of this green stuff. Get 
Hey, green stuff. Ooh, it's green a stuff. And you, it's got Miracle Grow hair tonic all over it. <laughs> green stuff. So, this has been Quimpact with Let's Play Sam and Max Hits the Road. Don't forget to subscribe, rate, and comment next time. Bumpusville! I'm sure our missing Bigfoot is in here somewhere. But where? That's what really matters. Oh, probably some musical numbers. See you then!